Okay, so in this episode, we are going to see why you want to use mail trap. So with that, I'm your host Sarthak and this is a channel where I talk about Laravel and the cool thing about Laravel. So if you are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe and like Bitfumes on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram. So why you want to use mail trap? The simple answer is because if you are using Gmail, then you will probably get many kinds of error if you are using Gmail. Okay, so the answer for this question why you want to use mail trap is very simple because it's very easy to implement and easy to work with this. Okay, you just have to log in or you just have to sign up with Google and GitHub also. So I would like to log in with Google and after login I will get some kind of mailing system like like an inbox and here is the inbox so inside here you can see i have this demo inbox so let's open this demo inbox and inside here you can see this is the credentials we need to configure in our dot env file okay so let's first use this email system to send email on my bitfumes at gmail.com via gmail system so let's see uh, I will open my Gmail first so that we can see how the email is looking like and then I will go to Laravel documentation and search for mail and here is the mail and I will go to send email and before sending creating send email system we need to create the mailable so let's first create the mailable so I will go here, I will say php artisan make mail. Uh, oh yeah, mail name is, um, let's say mail trap. Yeah, mail trap and mail is ready. So I will just open sublime for this project. And you can see the mail is here, the mailable is here. And here what we can do, I will just send email to um, let's say bitfumes at gmail.com okay and we have to create a view which is having a name of let's say mail.blade.php so create that mail here so I will create mail here so mail.blade.php and inside here I will create HTML5 markup so here it is and inside body I want one h1 tag which says this is test email very simple thing now open any controller so let's see we have any controller no we have to create a controller oops so we have to create a controller so let's create controller php artisan make controller controller name is mail controller it's created let's see here it is and create a function so function name is let's say index oops here we have to return no we don't have to return now come back to the documentation and here inside documentation you can see we have this thing so we need to copy this from here and paste it here so that we can send email so instead of giving the email here I will copy this thing from here and paste it here so it will be like this and we don't need this arrow so and our mailable name is only mail so no need to pass anything so I think we need to import this mail so what I will do I will use command shift and P or control shift P and use PHP companion find use if you are not familiar with, with PHP companion you can find a link on the description for its tutorial on bitfumes so here it is and it's done I think so let's see um, okay that's nice so let's create a route for this so create a route simply create route of get 
say send mail and it will go to um, which controller <laughs> mail controller so mail controller I think yeah okay at index close this open here go to slash send mail let's see uh, oh <laughs> index index refresh uh, the past argument send must be an instance of let's see what the error here is okay so what we can do I because my mail name mailable name is not mail it's mail trap let's refresh again aha uh -huh, mail trap is not found so we have to import this also again press ctrl shift and p find use that's it refresh again let's see what the error we are getting so i think yeah so this error we are getting because i have not configured my env file so let's just quickly configure my env file so here so instead of mail trap i will use smtp dot gmail dot com port is good username i know it's bitfumes at gmail dot com it's gmail dot com password obviously i don't want to show you and encryption will be tls okay so so let's try again and here it is and if you are using localhost by using php artisan serve then you have to restart your server so let's refresh this page and let's see wait 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 so i'm getting this error and if you are getting this kind of error you have to do one thing go to your email and then go to my accounts not accounts it's only account then sign in and security then just at the bottom you will see allow less secure apps it's off now but I will start it now I will refresh this page again and let's see what we are getting so it's doing something and yes we are getting blank page that means our email is here so this is the email but this is lots of thing we have to do let's try this with mail trap so so let's open and let's copy these things so it's smtp.mailtrap.io so instead of smtp.gmail.com i will paste it from here and port name is anything so 2525 is nice so 2525 and username is this so instead of this thing username is this password is this thing and and password is this so remove this space and everything is good so what it will do i will just show you so i will again refresh this page and go to mail trap and here you can see mail trap it's the same thing this is test email we are having on the view this is test email and now the question arise I have used to send on bitfumes at gmail.com but I am getting that email here not inside my gmail this is the beauty of mail trap because it's only for your testing it's not for your original thing obviously when you are uploading this project on the server then you will use the server configurations you don't need gmail you don't need mail trap nothing the server configuration so here it's only for your testing whether your email system you have created is working or not so this is the simple thing simplest thing and one more thing i want to show you is that when i go to my demo inbox and i will find these things so i can reset all these things so that I you will not going to use my 
SMTP my mail trap information so when I hit reset and it will reset everything that means username and password and now username and password is resetted so now this username and password is no longer valid and my email will not get on mail trap mail trap name suggest mail trapping system okay so it traps every email you will send anywhere doesn't matter it will trap that email and show you the email system you have created is correct so if you have any problem in this episode or anywhere please feel free to message me don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to like bitfumes on facebook twitter and instagram we will meet in the next episode with some awesome new things till then goodbye